Hello and welcome to the Estadio Urbano Caldera, Hungary against Germany. It's John Champion with you today and alongside me, top analyst Jim Beglin. Yeah, thanks John. Well, we have great expectation here today for both sets of players. I mean, this match really promises something good. Jerome Boateng. Mario Goetze. Real pressure from the opposition there. A long ball into space. Muller, chance. Now seeking to get that ball in. Here's Kadira. He decides to shoot. That was certainly struck well enough. And that's a very, very good strike too. I mean, he kept it very low and the keeper doesn't like it. Well, that should set them on their way and get into a nice rhythm. The early signs are very encouraging now. Mario Goetze. That's a clever ball from him. Well played, that got them out of trouble. Driven in. He's not taking any risks there. Germany have possession again. Some dangerous moments, but he was there to intervene. Both teams on the front foot from the start. It bodes well. Tony Cruz. Schweinsteiger. No goals as yet from either team. Pass cut out. He didn't have any luck with the through ball there. I timed this run brilliantly, and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with, with the passer then, and I think he's letting him know right now about that. Just a little more behind it was needed. Jerome Boateng. Mario Goetze. Going forward. Looking to carve open the defence. The flag stays down. Oh, that's delightful. Jumps for the header. No, lacked control in the end. Yeah, and it all came from very good trickery in the, in the wider position, but quite a static defence was pretty fortunate to survive that little episode. It should have been much worse. Plays it through. Cleared by the defence. into space out wide up for that one great build up pity about the outcome Germany didn't really deal with the white play it was a, a lovely dribble down the flank but really they've got to double up to try and stop that and I think with the attempted goal too they were a little fortunate so who is going to spark this game into life Wonderful through ball over the top. He's onside. And the cross. And the cross dealt with. It's an opportunity. Hungary have scored. He hit that, and my word, it stayed hit. Well, once upon a time I was harsh on goalkeepers, but now I'm more sympathetic because the ball moves all over the place these days and we've just seen it again. So we start again at 1-0. Yeah, they may have got the lead, but that next goal now is absolutely crucial to the complexion of this one. It's Muller.
the keeper wins. Muller. Opportunity for a goal. Muller is a judge to be offside. Cashier. It's been launched forward. Only five minutes until the break now. In he goes, and that's a good tackle. Herbedes. Tony Cruz. Hedera. Schweinsteiger. Herbedes plays it long. Through it goes. And they get it away. The whistle goes to signify half-time. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. It's a cagey game, this one. Plenty to fascinate the spectators, though. The score is 1-0. Cuts it out. Plenty of options. Who's he looking to pick out? Up to nod it. Hungary with a big chance and a big miss. Mario Goetze. He's going on his own. Space on the flank. It's on for him. Muller. It's a corner. Metasacher, Mario Götze, Metaturzel, strikes it, they were so nearly punished for their mistake. Ah, oh, good interception, just what they needed. Jerome Boateng, Mats Hummels, Herbedes, Mats Hummels, Metasacher, Kedira, Jerome Boateng plays it long. The danger was there, he dealt with it well. Hungary, not as yet making any changes. Throw in. It was good possession, but way too elaborate. Completely overworked. Tony Cruz. Metasacher. Jerome Boateng. done that well look John this is what they have to do now well Jim you can't do anything but plough forward at this stage can you it has to be done he's looking to play it into the channel hits it a fine reaction save he scores Two goals to the good, and they're set fair. Given the time and space he had, he was never likely to miss. I think when you can see the goal like that, the manager has to start questioning his personnel, because to allow someone into that position, totally unmarked, I think that's reckless in the extreme, I really do. So, it's now two without reply. Well, at 1 0, this game was very much in the balance, but at 2 0, they ought to be able to defend this lead from here. 
He plays it through. And that's gone straight to the keeper. Hervadez. Tony Cruz. The ball's with Miller. The opposition posing a few questions, but he's able to intercept. And half an hour of this second half. Jerome Boateng gets it away. Tony Cruz. Herbertes. Through into space it goes. Here's Muller. That's probably caused a few size. The quicker an attacker gets the ball under control, the more time he creates for himself. That was very neat and tidy to set up the shot. Cashier. Good strong run down the right, now looking though for some support. They really should have made it 3-0 there. And he really went for it there, he knew that was the moment when he could have made the tie safe. It should have been a three-goal lead. Time whistle within sight. Jerome Boateng going forward for maybe the final time. Intercepts the pass. Here's a header. The finish was not what was required. Two more minutes is being shown on the board. Moving forwards, looking to carve open the defence. Great footwork. It's opened up nicely for him. He's done very well there. And that's it, the final whistle. Simply magnificent performance by the players here, who fit in absolutely everything. All the hard work's paid off and they've come away with a wonderful victory. Look, that's what supporters love to see. Tremendous will and spirit, crunching tackles and a real desire to attack. Nobody could feel let down by that.